Okay, so you've tested your lens, you've created a lens, you're ready to publish, right? Almost, just a second. We need to head into the project info first and make sure we have the lens name, icon, and preview. Okay, so here in Lens Studio, we need to give our lens a name, icon, and preview. And we do that through the project info. Now, before we go in there, I'm just going to take a quick screenshot of this to use as my icon. So I'm going to change uh, to the rear camera so I get this kind of more world view. And I'll just take a screenshot with this to quickly save an image of what it sees. Now, I just took a screenshot of the preview panel for my icon, but feel free to design an icon in some software of your choice. Now, in the project info, I'll give my lens a name. Let's call this cool grain. I'll add an icon by just clicking this button. And once you've loaded that, uh, you can kind of move this around the image. You can scale it down, and scale it up, whatever you want to do. So I'll just grab a few of the palm trees here for my icon. I'll hit apply. Now we need the preview. If I click this button, um, it'll take a minute to load. It's going to actually apply your lens to every single preview video that Lens Studio has. And then it'll also let you upload a video with the lens and a video without the lens. If there's no lens on the video, it will apply it for you. So you can go and use a default preview. Uh, now this is perfectly fine. I use them a lot, um, but if you really want to stand out, you should use a custom preview. Now you can send your lens to Snapchat, record a preview. You just need to make sure it is an MP4 file and cropped to nine by 16. An alternative would be to use a website like pexels.com to find a video to use as your preview. So I'm here and I'm just going to search for happy smiling person. And I want to go to videos. I'm going to change the orientation to vertical. Now we have lots of great videos that we can use. Okay, so I found this video of some people dancing. So I'm going to click on it. And we want a certain resolution. So I'm not going to click free downloads. I'm going to hover my mouse over the arrow. And I want 720 by 1280. It's not the highest res resolution video. But remember that these previews are pretty small. They're inside the app. They don't need to be super high res. And I have issues with anything above 720 by 1280. So grab this resolution. Go ahead and download it. Once you've downloaded the video, come back to Lens Studio. And we want to upload the video without the lens. So choose file and find your video. All right, so once you've selected your video, it'll take just a few moments to apply the lens and you can see it here now. Now it is speeding it up. It kind of compresses the time frame of the video. So don't spend a long time crafting a preview. Just choose something that looks pretty good. Now, the last thing we want to do here is I'm going to change the hint. And this is something that Snapchat will display for you. Now, since you can tap to change, I'm going to come down here to tap and select that and then click apply. And that is it for setting up our project info and we are ready to move on to submission.